Welcome to my channel I am blessed. Today's audiobook is all about Hang In There edited by Patricia Wyant Like. Life can be hard sometimes, but it's going to be okay. Life isn't always easy, and when you or someone you care about is facing challenges or problems, it helps to remember that hard times don't last forever and joy will come again, this uplifting collection is the perfect mix of encouragement and understanding. The writings by some of Blue Mountain's art's most popular authors. Including Susan Polis Schutz, Douglas Paggles, and Donna Fargo Hart in a readers to hang in there and believe in the promise of tomorrow. When you or a loved one is coping with an unexpected change, a loss, or everyday struggles, these words of wisdom will help make the journey a little easier. Read them anytime you need a boost or just a reminder that you can handle whatever challenges life brings your way. Life Can Be Hard Sometimes By Donna Fargo Life is full of surprises some good and some not so good. When your world has been turned upside down, remember just as there are clear skies and brighter days after a hard rain, the stormy weather in your life will also change. Life hurts sometimes, but you are a survivor and you will make the best of the situation. You will find the positive ways to handle disappointment, you will learn valuable lessons, and you will discover strengths to empower you. Life has its seasons, but seasons change, and you will get through this. It's going to be okay by Terry Bernson. There will be times when you're going to need so much courage. There will be times when you feel like crying yourself to sleep. When your confidence is shaken. When you're scared, angry and confused. When you can't believe this is happening to you, but for every one of those situations, there will also be times when you look deep inside and realize you're going to be okay. There will be times when you find out that you're such a fighter. When you discover how strong you really can be and that you're truly a survivor, the people with the biggest hearts are the ones who can be most vulnerable sometimes. But they are also the ones who have the capacity to hold on tight and find a way through, you're one of those people. They say hard times make us stronger by Jason Bloom, the challenges you face will bring you lessons and change you in positive ways you never imagined. You will find that you are stronger than you ever knew. You will learn that you are loved and cared for and things can turn out okay even when it seems impossible. You will find that even the hardest times pass. Just hold on and keep your spirits up by Brian Gill. Never forget what a treasure you are. Try to realize how important you are in the eyes of the world. No matter where you go, hopes and hearts travel beside you every step of the way. Even though difficulties come to everyone, it is in fear when they hang around longer than they should. But until I knew they comes along, trust that you'll always be strong enough to see things through. Remember how much strength and courage you have inside. You can find all the patience it takes. You can turn to the times in the past when challenges were met, when you survived, when you were rewarded with success in when you learned to believe in so much within you. You have so much going for you, and you're going to see your way through anything that comes along. Brighter days are going to find a way to shine in your windows and chase away any blues. Because no one deserves more smiles, success, friendship or love than you. You can accomplish anything you put your mind to by Julie Rogics. Inner strength, determination and courage aren't just words they are part of who you are. Look within yourself, and you will find the strength to rise to any challenge. Know that even the smallest a step forward is important and brings you closer to your goals. It may be hard, but nothing comes easily. Remember that beyond the clouds is the brilliant blue of the sky. Life's finest moments will come after you've the weather the storm. If you believe, anything is possible. 10 Golden Rules for a Better Life by Donna Fargo, 1. Live your life with purpose, don't just do whatever or whatever might just be what you get, too. Develop a compassionate spirit and a loving heart, you will feel better about yourself and others will feel better about you, 3. Be honest and guard your integrity no matter what the rest of the world is doing, they're not the ones here have to live with you, you are, 4. Believe in yourself and always do what's right, a clear conscience will keep you on the right path. 5. Be as good as your word and don't make promises you're not going to keep. 6. Be fair to others, especially those less fortunate, there may come a time you have to walk in their shoes. 7. 
Keep a positive attitude and speak encouraging words, you hear them or rise up in you when you need them, and others will remember them when they need lifting up. 8. Don't take your natural talents for granted, use them to nourish your soul and to touch lives, and they will be multiplied. 9. When you feel discouraged or unlucky, remember the time that you've been fortunate, and that knowledge will help balance out your fears. 10. Remember that what you do today will show up tomorrow, so when you make important decisions think about tomorrow today. Courage is not the absence of fear it is feeling our fears and facing them anyway, the challenges you're facing are not easy. But one step at a time, you will get through them because you are strong, resilient and powerful, and you have the love and support the people who will stand beside you. You are a courageous person. You've come through hard times before Mu come through this, too, you are stronger than you know. By Jason Bloom But why me? Judith Mammy, sometimes we are overwhelmed with the obstacles we are given in our lives, and we ask why me? And often, when the answers elude us, we believe that the trials through which we suffer are unfair and harsh. But there are answers, even though we may not recognize them. In this world, we are all connected and there is a reason for whatever happens. We must remain strong in the face of adversity and meet the challenges one day at the time, and as time heals us, both body and soul, we may come to understand the meaning of our trials and recognize the good that came from them. We may take pride in knowing that we made it through them and as a result are much stronger than we were before. Life is what you make it, Paula Michelle Adams Life has a way of throwing us off course, surprising us into making changes we were planning on making. Things make it difficult, and you may struggle to do what's right. But each new day brings new hope and offers us a new chance to get it right. Don't focus on what was. Look forward to what can be, and then all you can do to make it a reality. Life is what you make of it, and the challenges that come your way are opportunities to right what is wrong. Don't get discouraged and don't give up. You have it all inside yourself, and you can overcome anything if you put your mind to it. Sometimes you just need to start over Douglas Paggles, when it's time for a new beginning. You need faith. That things will be better, you need strength. And you find it within, you need patience and persistence. You need hope and you need to keep it close to the center of everything that means the most to you, you need to put things in perspective. So much of your life lies ahead. You need to know how good it can be, you need to take the best of what you've learned for from the old. And bring it to the beautiful days of a new journey, life's new beginnings happen for very special reasons. When it's time to move on, remember that it really is okay. Because when a new beginning unfolds in the story of your life, you go such a long way toward making the dreams of your tomorrows come true. If you want rainbows, you gotta have a rain. By Susie Toronto, in a perfect world, everything would always go right. There would be no disappointments or trials, and life would be filled with only sweet, warm, and fuzzy feelings, but how would we know if things were good if we had no comparison? Would we recognize the blessings in our lives without having the opposite to compare them to, without the darkness, would we appreciate the light, seems to me that if we want rainbows. We gotta have rain. The trick is to pull ourselves up by our bootstraps and go out and look for puddles to play in, recognize the tempest for what it is and train ourselves to look for the good in every situation. By overcoming our adversity, we find the joy in everything. So go on, go play in the rain. The Path to Recovery by Douglas Paggles, Recovery is, breaking free, finding the strength, and having every ounce of faith it takes. It's earning and deserving a new beginning in facing the day with hope. It's being able to cope with anything that comes along and staying healthy on every step of the journey, the journey is a lifelong process that happens day by day. It's one that takes you away from guilt and pain. It's a path that will bring you closer to your loved ones and bring you so much joy and self-esteem. And it's one that leads to so much serenity, Serenity is the reward for having the determination to make it work and working, step by step, to get it right. It's relying on strength and courage in all the support you need to have a new and very special life. God's gift to every one of us is that we can mend and begin again and never give up. 
Serenity is the sun that follows the storm, and it's the warmth of knowing how good life can be. Tomorrow is a new day by Susan Polis Schutz, sometimes we do not feel like we want to feel. Sometimes we do not achieve what we want to achieve, sometimes things that happen do not make sense, sometimes life leads us in directions that are beyond our control, it is at these times, most of all that we need someone who will quietly understand us and be there to support us. I want you to know that I am here for you in every way and remember that other things may be difficult now, tomorrow is a new day. When one door closes, another one opens by Alan Austin, you are a very deserving person. And when someone like you has experienced a difficult time, there is a place you can count on to be there for you. That place is in the hearts of others and in the comfort and care of every wish in every prayer. As one door closes, you move on, but you do not journey alone. And in your time of need another door does open, and it leads to a place where the days truly do get brighter and the load really get does get lighter, may you find peace in knowing that somewhere up ahead a brand new door is opening on a brand new day, and may your hopes for serenity and your prayers for guidance beautifully show you the way. Be strong and don't give up by Pamela Owens Renfro, remember there's a deeper strength and an amazing abundance a peace available to you. Draw from this well, call on your feet to uphold you. You will make it through this time and find joy in life again, life continues around us, even when our troubles seem to stop time. There is good in life every day. Take a few minutes to distract yourself from your concerns long enough to draw strength from a tree or to find pleasure in a bird's song. Return a smile, realize that life is a series of levels, cycles of ups and downs, some easy, some challenging. Through it all, we learn, we grow strong in faith, we mature in understanding. The difficult times are often the best teachers, and there's good to be found in all situations. Reach for the good. Resilience by Caroline Comerford, I am driven by the beauty of a sunrise, an early morning autumn breeze, a good cup of coffee. I am driven by my inner strength and my desire to be what I have within me, I am driven by hope and the poetry I know I can write, I am driven by my husband's glistening eyes and my many silly nicknames in how he says I have a heart with an endless capacity for love. I am driven by my puppy's head on my lap in the way she devised me unless I have treats. I am driven by how we are all connected, I am driven because we are the same, I am driven by the beauty and generosity of people who give kindness, understanding, a wide smile, a helping hand, I am driven to put away sorrow and fear and return the favor, to celebrate the blessings and to shape thank you in this way, to mend and to give that which is good to others, I am driven to rediscover joy, do not give up, to find me again. You deserve a medal for your strength and courage by Bonnie St. John, sometimes you fight your way through battle after battle and show your strength and courage by being a warrior. You wait, listen to your heart, find wisdom to take the right path, and show your strength and courage by being patient. You stand up for what you believe in, Say no to that which is not compatible with your values, and show your strength and courage by being true to yourself. You open your doors for yourself even when you seem too tired to go on. You find the energy to see a new dawn, a new point of view and create a new direction where none seems possible. You show your strength and courage by being optimistic. No matter how many times you are knocked down, you continue to rise again. You deserve a medal to honor your strengths and courage. When you must, you can. By Douglas Paggles, it's just a few simple words, but this old saying contains one of the best reminders there is, and it is a wonderful thing to keep in mind, there have been times when I found myself wondering. How am I going to make it through? What can I possibly do to remedy a certain problem? How am I ever going to figure out what direction to go from here? And then I remember those words, when you must, you can, that praise has proven itself to be true in almost everything I've done. I have had days when I found strength inside me that I didn't even know I had. I have found answers to questions I thought I'd never solve. 
I have surprised myself with my ability to rise above certain situations and stay on top of what it takes to find my serenity. At times when I didn't think I could go on another day, I reached deep and kept the faith. You can handle any problems that life brings by Susan Polis Schutz. I know that lately you have been having problems and I just want you to know that you can rely on me for anything you might need. But more important keep in mind at all times that you are very capable of dealing with any complications that life has to offer. So do whatever you must, feel whatever you must, and keep in mind at all times that we all grow wiser and become more sensitive and are able to enjoy life more after we go through hard times. At any given point in time there are hundreds of thoughts moving through our minds. Many times we worried about a moment that has passed or a day that has yet to come, and many of us talk down to ourselves for mistakes and misgivings, leaving no room for forgiveness. What we should realize is that we too, are human and deserve the same forgiveness and kindness that we pass along to others. So stop where you are and change your negative thoughts. Replace them with something great about you. You have so much going for you, you just have to take a moment to recognize it. By Lamisha Surf Don't forget to take care of yourself by Linda Sackett Morrison. Today, if only for a few moments, lay your burden aside and remember that there are people who care about you and are ready to help. Set aside anger, worry, and endless task, be soothed by the love and kindness that surround you. Do what integrity dictates, but take time to care for yourself. Be recharged and lifted in mind, body, and spirit. Be kind to yourself, as you are to others, and accept the love and comfort that are offered. Today, if only for a few moments, let your burdens be by someone else's strength. Listen to your heart and trust your intuition, by Donna Fargo. Your heart is listening and talking to you. It hears everything you say, knows everything you do and feels everything you're feeling. It knows your secrets and regrets, faults and assets, weaknesses and strengths. It knows your family and the influences other people have had on you. It knows your habits and the state of your health. It knows your deepest desires and proudest moments. It wants to help you. It will make suggestions to you in a still, small voice that may come to you in unexpected ways, like something you just happen to hear or see or read. Sometimes you may want to ignore it because you think your mind will have better advice, but your heart will never steer you wrong. Trust what you hear when your heart is talking to you. It holds your hopes and dreams. But it is not an inactive guardian or an idle keeper, it feels your hunger and understand your purpose in life. It knows what do you need to do to fulfill that purpose the changes you need to make and the methods that will assist you in making them. It will collect all the options unique to you to help you make the best choices for your life. Like a good friend, it will caution you and encourage you. It communicates with you through your intuition, and if you listen, it will help you find opportunities you never dreamed were possible. Practice listening to your heart and don't be afraid to trust its guidance. Believe in your power to make things better by Paula Finn. Sometimes it's hard to understand how things can turn out so wrong when your hopes were so high and your intentions so good. But life has a way of balancing sorrow with joy, disappointment with hope, and emptiness with meaning. You will look back on the most painful experiences as times of healing, growth and discovering your own strengths. You can see them as a challenge to forgive the past and trust the future, to feel the pain and move beyond it, and to believe in life, the hope of each tomorrow, in the gift of every day, 
believe in yourself and in your power to create your own best future, to attract the things you need, the people you love, and all the joy you deserve. Grace will carry you, by Lisa May Huddleston, no matter where you have been, no matter what you have done, no matter how lost you may feel, grace will carry you, when the road of life becomes uncertain and many questions seem to go unanswered, look up and smile, receive each day's blessings with gladness, for it is the twists and turns of life that takes you on a journey he wouldn't have traveled otherwise. All crossroads have a purpose. One day you will look back and realize that if it wasn't for the crossroad with all its uncertainty, he would have never have made it to where you were meant to be. In that moment of arrival, you will know that you were never alone. You will know that your questions were indeed answered with a voice of compassion and love that guided you safely home. Every night has its day. Every valley has its mountaintop. Every problem has a solution. Every down has its up. Every frown has a smile to it. You must be patient, wait and you will see. Life is full of ups and downs, mountains and valleys, smiles and frowns. But friendship is there to be found. Love is there to be found. Bright moments are there to be found and therein lies the beauty. By Ashley Rice Dreams Can Come True by Susan Polis Schutz Dreams can come true if you take time to think about what you want in life, get to know yourself, find out who you are, choose your goals carefully, be honest with yourself, but don't think about yourself so much that you analyze every word and action, don't become preoccupied with yourself. Find many interests and pursue them, find out what is important to you. Find out what you are good at. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. Work hard to achieve successes. When things are not going right, don't give up. Just try harder. Find courage inside of you to remain strong. Give yourself freedom to try out new things. Don't be so set in your ways that you can grow. Always act in an ethical way, laugh and have a good time, form relationships with people you respect, treat others as you want them to treat here, be honest with people, accept the truth. Speak the truth, open yourself up to love, don't be afraid to love. Remain close to your family. Take part in the beauty of nature. Be appreciative of all that you have. Help those less fortunate than you. Try to make other lives happy, work toward peace in the world. Live life to the fullest. You will win this battle, by Donna Fargo, you're strong like a beautiful tree in the forest. You have experienced the winds of change and challenge, and you are still standing. Like the roots of a beautiful tree in the forest rich down into the earth, your foundation of faith and spirituality will give you firmly planted, when you've done all you think you can, stay determined. When you're doubtful and frustrated, don't give up. When you can see tomorrow, just get through today. Keep on keeping on. You will win. Don't despair. Storms and the weather made that big tree strong, and it's still standing too, just like you, in the quiet of your heart and minds, you may sometimes have questions, stay positive, and allow yourself to hope and dream, to rest and relax. Believe that all things are possible and you will be empowered. Believe that you will win this battle. Keep these bits of wisdom close to your heart by Linda E. Knight. If a star twinkles, wish on it. When you spot a rainbow, search for the gold. Walk on the sunny side, dream on a cloud. Always remember that life is meant to be enjoyed, 
be gracious, angels are watching. Unfold your wings, rise and soar. Fill your life with wonder and your days with beauty. Set your dreams on the farthest star. When you're caught between a rock and a hard place, plant a seed. Chart your course. Map out your future. Sail away on your own cruise line, and remember there is no limit to how far you can go. Believe in miracles. Look for silver linings. When the going gets tough, let faith smooth the way. Dreams come in all shapes and sizes. Do the things that warm your soul. Inspire yourself. Make good things happen. In every tomorrow a new promise shines, believe in yourself. Honor your strengths. A little hope and determination can overcome anything. Life is a candle. And you're its spark. Soar high and far. Open your arms, and let life's good things come in. God has some spectacular moments designed due for you and no one is more deserving than you, leave your wishes. Blaze your own trail straight to the stars. Wherever you go take a prayer with you. Follow your vision wherever it leads. Life is a gift and so are you. May wisdom, love, creams and angels walk with you always. Stay on your chosen path, by Marion Wilson, there are many paths to success. Some are easy, but those are very rare and not without consequences. Other paths are such a struggle, a difficult climb all the way, sometimes the more you have to fight for something, the more it's worth it in the end. True that struggle, you gain a greater sense of accomplishment and a deeper feeling of satisfaction. When you are facing struggles in your life, you may look for another way out. Stay your course. Don't to veer from your chosen path. Remember a struggle is just another path to success. Whenever two ways lie before us, one of which is easy and the other hard, one of which requires no exertion while the other calls for resolution and endurance, happy are those who choose the mountain path and scorn the thought of resting in the valley. These are the men and women who are the stand in the end to conquer and succeed. Unknown Perhaps a strength doesn't recite and never having been broken but in the courage required to grow strong in the broken places, unknown, above the cloud with its shadow is the star with its light. By Victor Hugo Just do your best by Susan Polis Schutz, sometimes you may think that you need to be perfect, that you cannot make mistakes, at these times, you put so much pressure on yourself. Try to realize that you are like everyone else, capable of reaching great potential but not capable of being perfect. Just do your best and realize that this is enough. Don't compare yourself to anyone. Be happy to the wonderful unique, very special person that you are. Take it one day at a time by Donna Fargo. You can do more than you think you can. Try to embrace the obstacles in your life as lessons and see every goal as reachable. Be patient. You will dream new dreams in time. You'll find the keys that open the doors to your changing world, for those mountains that don't seem to budge, you will find a way to move them. May your problems actually be opportunities in disguise. Every time your heart is broken, May you find a way to put it back together even stronger than ever. For those feelings of insecurity, may you get in touch with your power source inside you. Have hope. Have faith. Believe in miracles. May your disappointments turn into stepping stones. 
May these new circumstances transcribe the writing on the wall into positive actions you can take. As you deal with your loneliness and examine all your wishes that may be hiding in your heart, may you have an angel to walk beside you, friends who will always be there, and answers to ever pray that you pray. Find a mantra to say over and over when you're discouraged, like I am strong and the best is yet to come. Angels are waiting over you, by Candy Pull, there are angels among us. You may have encountered one lately. It may have been someone who offered an encouraging word, a helping hand, or a simple smile. Angels know how to touch through human hands and love through human hearts. It doesn't take a miracle to recognize when an angel has been at work. Just open your eyes and watch for love in action. Angels are everywhere. Seen or unseen, they lift spirits. Encourage the downhearted, and offer heavenly health for down-to-earth problems. If you hear the sound of wings remember, angels are watching over you. Keep faith beside you by Rachel Snyder, when all else fails and melts away, faith remains. Like a flower that blossoms in the midst of a storm, your faith will grow and bloom when you least expect it. When you feel you've prayed every prayer and wished every wish, faith will knock gently and ask to be let in. Choose faith and you choose life. Choose faith and you choose courage. Choose faith and you choose to follow the urgings of your spirit, no matter what hardships are tearing at your heart. There is no test to prove yourself worthy of faith. Simply invite her in, and you feel the arms of faith wrap around you and embrace you with quiet comfort. You'll rest in the knowing that faith is an unspoken prayer that will never leave your side. If you have but one wish, let it be that faith stays with you always. For with faith beside you, you will never be alone. The sun will shine again by Jason Bloom. When we are in the midst of a storm, sometimes it's hard to believe the sun is waiting to shine again. But God's love is just like the sun even when you cannot see it, it is waiting to fill your days and your heart with warmth and light. Trust that every hard time ends, that prayers are answered, sometimes quickly, sometimes slowly and that rainbows follow the rain. You will come through this challenge. And when you look back, you will. See it has made you stronger and given you give you never imagined. Happiness is a choice within as all, by Lamisha Surf. Many people believe that happiness is a place you get to after years of dreaming and thinking if only. Some people believe that happiness the money in the bank, the car in their driveway or the clothes on their back. Others know that happiness isn't a place or an item that can be seen and felt. They know it is a way of living in an attitude of being. Happiness is a choice. Every day that we make, we have an opportunity to bring happiness to ourselves and others by simply making a choice to do so. Even in desperate times, in times of sorrow and fear, we have the choice to look on the bright side of every event that comes our way. If you can take a moment and think of what makes you happy, you will find that happiness isn't in things, it's simply within us all. We all have the ability to experience happiness, no matter what life throws at us. We just have to make the choice. So many people care about you, by Maria Mullins, you may think you are alone at the moment, and you may feel as if you are just soldiering on. But he couldn't be more wrong, because you have a whole army of people behind you, so the next time you feel alone with your problems or feel downhearted in any way, remember that army of supporters behind you, people who care about you and are wishing you well. May this thought make you feel a whole lot better and help to keep you strong. Wherever you go, leave good footprints, by Nancy Sims. Life is a precious journey we all take. Each decision we make an indelible footprint, 
for good or bad, success or failure, happiness or sorrow. So walk carefully in with much thought, for your footprints will follow you wherever you go, make good footprints. Walk in love. Reach out in kindness. Speak peace. Harm no one. Be a light for goodness. Live in truth. Spread hope. Embrace others. Build bridges. Be a friend to all. Show compassion. Champion respect. Give your best. Do what is right. Make a difference. Everyone can. Live your life in such a thoughtful and honorable way that when you or others look back on the landscape of your life, you will feel proud of the footprints you have left behind. Good footprints will not only allow you to live well, happy and at peace. They will make this world which sometimes seems so crazy a better place because it was graced by your presence, blessed by your spirit, and gifted by the bright legacy you left, wherever you go in this life, leave good footprints behind you. Bless the Challenges You've Weathered, by Rachel Snyder, Every Rock in the Road, Bless It, Every Pain, Every struggle, forgive it, every tear shed, every mournful wail, every storm that's knocked you down, bless them all. Thank your body for waking you up, for healing, be grateful to your heart for leading you to greater love, honor your courage to heed the call to grow, hard as it has been. Every challenge has strengthened your will and enlivened your spirit, bless them. All, and you will be blessed. Always Hope for the Best by Nancy Sims, Don't Let Go of Hope Hope gives you the strength to keep going when you feel like giving up, don't ever quit believing in yourself. As long as you believe you can, you will have a reason for trying. Don't let anyone hold your happiness in their hands, hold it in yours, so it will always be within your reach. Don't measure success or failure by material wealth but by how you feel, our feelings determine the richness of our lives. Don't let bad moments overcome you, be patient, and they will pass. Don't hesitate to reach out for help, we all need it from time to time. Don't run away from love but the word love, because it is our deepest joy. Don't wait for what you want to come to you. Go after it with all that you are, knowing that life will meet you halfway. Don't feel like you've lost when plans and dreams fall short of your hopes. Anytime you learn something new about yourself or about life, you have progressed. Don't do anything that takes away from your self-respect. Feeling good about yourself is essential to feeling good about life. Don't ever forget how to laugh or be too proud to cry. It is by doing both that we live life to its fullest. These words will have you get through just about anything, by Douglas Paggles, stay positive, hopeful people are happier people, choose wisely, good choices will come back to bless you, remember what matters, the present moment. The good people in it. Hopes and dreams and feelings, don't stress out over things you can't control, just don't, count every blessing, even the little ones add up to a lot, be good to your body, it's the only one you get, listen to the wishes of your heart, it always seems to know what's true. What's right, what to do and where to go with your life, understand how special you are, realize how strong you can be. And know that, Yes, you're going to make it through, no matter what. Maybe you won't be dancing in the streets or jumping on the bed, but you are going to get through the day, the night and each and every moment that lies ahead. I promise. Everything is going to work out, Linda E. Knight, remember, things do work out. Storm Pass 
Hearts mend. Memories heal. And as each day rises new and fresh, so too will new dreams and purpose find their way to you. Be still. Stand strong. Steady. New beginnings filled with purpose are just ahead of you. Embrace the little things that you, the love of family, the hand of friendship, the prayers of all. May everything you hold dear come back to you, may strong words of hope give you courage. Know beyond a doubt that you already have all the faith you need. There are so many treasures yet to be found and so many tomorrows waiting for you. Push on to what lies ahead, and let love clear the way. You are such a very special soul, and you will get through this. Hang in there by Douglas Paggles, difficulties arise in the lives of us all. What is more important is dealing with the hard times, coping with the changes, in getting through to the other side where the sun is still shining just for you. It takes a strong person to deal with tough times and difficult choice. But you are a strong person. It takes courage. But you possess the inner courage to see you through. It takes being an active participant in your life. But you are in the driver's seat. And you can determine the direction you want tomorrow to go in, hang in there, and take care to see that you don't lose sight of the one thing that is constant, beautiful, and true. Everything will be fine, and it will turn out that way because of the special kind person you are, so beginning today and lasting a lifetime through, hang in there, and don't be afraid to feel like the morning sun is shining just for you. Thank you for listening to today's audiobook. Comment Subscribe to I Am Blessed for more free audiobooks.